Also when it comes to haram, like I said, two things we don't compromise, farad and haram. What that means is, if something is farad, we have no option. وَمَا كَانَ لِمُؤْمِنٍ وَلَا مُؤْمِنَةٍ إِذَا قَضَى اللَّهُ وَرَسُولُهُ أَمْرًا أَنْ يَكُونَ لَهُمُ الْخِيَارَةُ مِنْ أَمْرِهِمْ It's not befitting for a believing male or female that when Allah and His Messenger has dictated something, they then feel that they have a choice about it. True believers don't have a choice. They know if Allah said it, His Messenger said it, they've instructed it, they made it compulsory, I don't have a choice. They made it haram, I don't have a choice. If something is prohibited, it's prohibited. And if something is permissible, it is permissible, yes. But if it is compulsory and obligation, then I won't be able to do anything about it. I have to hold it exactly as Allah has held it.